Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video today. Uh, obviously as you can tell, it's my England-Sweden match preview. Uh, England reached the qualifiers uh, first time in 12 years I believe. I hope you're still shocked, I certainly am. Um, especially when I'm penalty shootout as, as well. Uh, didn't make it easy for us as such. Uh, if we did lose, I was going to put the blame on Southgate, um, but luckily no need to. I think Southgate needs to learn something when we only one go up. I think he needs to start learning that. We, um, when you go one new up, you don't change the system that early, but luckily we got away with it. Um, so guys, you know how this works, my 1 to 11, my thoughts on the game, so guys, subscribe for more, thanks for watching, and let's, do, and let's get into it. So, how I think the game's going to plan out, I think we're going to need to up our game a bit from the Columbia game. Um, as I said, we got away with it, luckily. Um, but if we play anything like that, I can see uh, Sweden not smash us, but beating us. Uh, horrible for me to say. I don't think we're going to get better chance of this World Cup with the likes of Portugal, Germany, Argentina, Spain, and all that out this competition. Uh, I think we need to pounce. We need to pounce now because I can't see another World Cup like this coming along anytime soon. Um, but let's just see what happens, guys. This is my one to eleven, uh, and obviously the new Premier League season is closing in as well. So, but anyway, this is my one to eleven, as I've just said. So in goal, I'm going with Jordan Pitford. Um, brilliant save uh, to win England the penalty shootout. Um, but uh, I think he could possibly save that corner. But anyway, I'm sticking in back in goal. And well done to you, Jordan Pitford. Uh, in right, in right wing back, I have gone with Carl Walker. Um, now, obviously, uh, we've only got the choice of two right backs, I believe. But I put Carl Walker in there because I know he's Sweden. I got picked dead spirits they've got and I know we're going to need dead spirits we've got so that's why I put Carl Walker in centre back I have gone with uh, Harry Maguire I uh, didn't have a bad game so sticking back in there uh, it's only th it's only three days to go now before we play again so um, in the uh, dead centre back I go with John Stones uh, we haven't really got no other choice but uh, Phil Jones. Uh, but anyway, I'll go with John Stones in this one as well. Uh, in the other centre back, I'll go with Gary Cahill. Um, as I said, you could possibly switch Stones and Cahill around, but. I don't think we will, I think that's how the squad would be set out. Or Maguire and Gay Hill to be switched from left to right. Um, in the left back position, I have gone with Ashley Young. I think that's how Gareth Southgate will go. Um, but this is just my 1 to 11. I ain't going to necessarily be the 1 to 11. But this will be mine as of in the past, this is my 1 to 11, a mix with Gareth Southgate's 11 that I believe would be the 11 that starts. Um, in the other, uh, sorry, on the left side of midfield, if he's not injured, he did pick up an injury uh, with the Columbia game, but hopefully he's fit. I'll go with Deli Ali. Um, now he hasn't got a lot. To, he hasn't got a lot to prove. He's had an injury. 
Um, a lot of our players were pulling up with cramp, but so for that one, I'll go with Daddy Ali. Uh, now in the centre mid, same person again, Jordan Henson. Uh, I didn't think he had a bad game um, against Colombia. Uh, so definitely give him another shout. And obviously, I'm not sure many of you knew this. Doof weren't actually there last night. Doof is, as far as I know at the minute, he's back over here to see his wife of his, uh, his child is due to be born any day now. I'm not sure if it has been born, but they had no doof out there, so that could have cost us as well. Uh, but hopefully he's back out there for this game and on that bench to start off with. Uh, on the right side, I go with Jesse Lingard. Had an excellent game uh, against Tunisia. Had another good game yesterday. Um, so, yeah, definitely stick Jesse Lingard back in there. Um, now, my two strikers are Harry Kane. Uh, obviously, took. Top goal scorer in this World Cup so far. He's going for the golden boot. Two nice penalties in the Columbia game. Um, so, you know, he's definitely going to be back in there. I can tell you that for sure. Uh, and the other change I'm going for, because I don't think Southgate will stick the other person there. I'll go with Raheem Sterling. Uh, I can't see Rash Marcus Rashford starting. I don't know personally why he's not starting. Um, you know, st there's a couple of situations that Sterling could have pulled us out of last night. You know, I think Rashford deserves a start in a big game. Why not give it to him? But for this one, I'll go Raheem Sterling. So that's my 1-11. to 11. That's my opinion of the game. Guys, you know what to do. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching and ciao for now.